Toggle set key mode. Our toggle set key mode is found down here. Toggle set key mode. Essentially what we're going to do is do a manually set keys. So the first thing we want to do is pick the viewport we want to be in. We're going to maximize that. Next, we're going to pick on the object, select an object. Now, I'm going to slide my slider bar around to roughly where I want it to, to be. And I'll start over here at about 12 or so. Next, I'm going to turn on my set key. When I turn on my toggle set key mode, it turns red. And now we're able to... Um, we're able to start our animation. Next, we're going to choose our set key button. I'm going to hit the set key button right here, and it starts the set key button. It will flash red, right, and it'll put a set key in there. Uh, and now it's set for the current position of the selected object. Now I want to drag my slider bar over to a position, let's say about 018 here. And then I can animate the selected object. I'm going to come over here and grab it and move it over to here. All right. And I'm going to actually turn it. I'm going to turn it. Ooh, I'm going to. And I'm actually going to go back to move, and I'll position in a little better parking job. And now I'm going to go along, and I'm going to hit the set, uh, set key again. And now I'm going to slide my slider bar over to about here, 22. And I'm going to hit the set key again. And now I'm going to move my object into place. And I'm going to set hit the set key. And now I'm going to turn off my uh, my uh, my toggle set key mode. And now I'm going to go back and take a look at my animation. I'm going to go back to my go to start. And I'm going to play my animation. And you can see in the beginning, nothing's really happening. Now, when I get up to about the 12 second mark, my, my car or box starts to move right here. Now it's starting to move, and it's turning and moving, and then it parks into the position, and then it stops. And then we finish the animation. So I'll go through that again. I'll stop it. And you can see right about here then is where my mark, my uh, set key starts. And so I'm going to start the animation. It starts off. It goes straight and turns because I did a rotation and a move. So it, it moved in between those two and then went. Now. Could I went straight for a while and then did a rotation? Yes. I was just trying to minimize the, the actual uh, key modes here so that you only seen a couple of them, not to get too confused. So this is different from the auto. The auto actually builds the, the, the keys for you. Um, but in this case, we built our, uh, our keys manually. So we turned on this toggle key mode and then we manually hit set the keys. And so uh, we told it when we wanted to have those positions and then we can play those. So we transform the object using our manual set keys button.